guys, it's my first vlog of the summer. I just finished my first year at East Chicago. Hello, I'm with Gabby. We're going to Wicker Park on a sushi adventure. Yeah. Wait, where are we going? Enso Sushi. Okay, yes. We have been trying to find good sushi in Chicago for like months and we've been unsuccessful, so yeah. please join us on our journey to looking for good sushi. And Gabby yeah, got these sunglasses for $15 at Target. They're very nice. <laughs> They're in mason jars. This is truly Wicker Park. <laughs> at this hair studio. I want to know how they got this name and why they're me. So many people in line for Jenny's right now. Literally insane. Insane. Worth it. A good boy. A very good boy. showed up yeah I can explain why I'm late though so like yes yes, yes you get out of work at three and yes I got out of work at three but let me tell you let me tell you a couple things that have been going on with my life are you ready for it all right okay. one I'm hella tired like I'm starting to get a little bit sick mm. and then two I had drama in my life recently drama From tinder yeah Ooh, tinder drama no, Henry's not, not life drama. status yeah honestly sadness in my life how excited though are you Lisa for Little Goat Diner? I'm really excited. Oh yeah. Okay, we're going to Little Goat Diner and we're taking you guys there. So it's, it'll it's, be fun. I've never been. You've Henry never been. Said it's it's so really good. I've been one time. It's really good. Okay. It's like okay. All right. In 2015, the city of Melbourne, Australia created a tree mail service in which all of the trees in the city received an email address so that residents could report any tree related issues. As an unexpected result, people began to email their favorite trees, sweets, and occasionally humorous letters. Imagine this has been expanded to any object, tree or otherwise, in the world, and share with us the letter you'd send to your favorite. What, what would it be for you? You have to say now. What, what would, would it, it be? be? You? Yeah, you uh, can send a letter to any object. Stuffed animals. Stuffed animals are my whole life. I had this one when I was a kid. It was a pig. I named her Piggy. Pi Why'd you name her Piggy? Because that's a good name for a pig, and I was five years old. Stop the hate. But I'm not trying to hate, like, I'm just saying Piggy. <laughs> Piggy, does she and need then to be reminded I named, that she's a pig? I named, I got a second one from my best friend and I named her Piggy 2.0 because I was so sad about this other pig. Cause like, I had Piggy for like 10 years and then these boys in my youth group played a prank on us um, when Did I was in like Piggy? eighth grade. No, they poured water on her and she got moldy and my mom threw her away. Yo. So, you're right, oh, straight disrespectful. Special.
three, what'd you think? Overpriced, but not bad. Um, so we started off with like the home fries that they have, and I think they had like some kimchi with like some cabbage stuff, which might just be kimchi, but it is like, oh no, pickled cabbages and yes. kimchi, I think. And it was pretty good. Then I had a chickpea like fritter salad, which was nice, but they, they tried their best, like a lot of like kind of like, you know, trying their best bougie restaurants like this will like step out of their lane and like make stuff that they just aren't good at making. So they had like falafel on it, but like it was like weird kind of falafel. It didn't taste really amazing. Dog. And like, oh. Okay, keep going. Then, oh yeah, but like, okay, so they had that and then they also had, um, to the right. Was that you? What else did I have? Oh, I also had the burger and it was like a Bon Me burger. And again, like they could try their best. Like I tried to pick up the burger and I couldn't because the, like the piece of bread on the bottom was like too soggy. Yeah. It's like I picked it up and the whole thing fell apart. And then the flavor was a little bit like bland and like their strategy for flavor is just to throw a bunch of flavorful things on the plate. It complements relatively well but not amazingly and also it's super okay. salty. Why would you have so yeah. overall I would give it I'm gonna have to hit it with I'm gonna have to hit it with three spoons out of five. All right, we came to Whole Foods because Henry is out here trying to buy some vegan groceries. So let's I'm about see what to he take gets. you. I'm about to take you to the best candy that exists on Earth. Follow me. I don't actually know where it is, but we're gonna look for it. All right, we're following Henry. Oh wait, come here. Oh my goodness. We gotta sniff the soap. Um. Mmm. Smell, smell, the soap. smell the soap. So okay. This one is good though. This is like root beer. Alright, let's see. Oh wow, that is so strong. <laughs> okay, there's more. Just edit this out. Mm. That's the last one. Pepper? This is spicier than white people have ever seen. Confirm this is <laughs> this is too spicy for me to even smell. Oh wow, that's too is... much seasoning. I have to put it back. That's pretty strong. Alternative milk. Look at all these snacks. So we gotta hold tight for a second. Or actually. Well, you you got so many. No. no, no. Okay. All right, so we got unreal peanut butter cups, right? These are the best candy of all time. Here, we're gonna try some after I buy it. Yeah. All right. Here, here we go. I'm all right. So now now it's me with the camera. And and Lisa, tell everyone how excited you are to eat this I'm peanut really butter cup. I'm really excited. It's it's unreal how excited I am right don't, now. Don't don't do that. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I have not really hyped this up, so if it's bad, I'm gonna be really mad, but okay. I'm surprised you've been my friend this long and I've never given you one of these. It's good. I, is it just good? Come on. It's good. I like it. Admit it's better than Reese's? I don't know. Because this peanut butter is like soft, and the Reese's peanut butter is like hard. So it depends what you like. Mm, that's true. Hello, Marge and I came to the family's belonging together, Marge. There's so many people here. I'm gonna show you. It's so cool to see how many people are coming together for this. We made signs. Marge is a much better sign maker than me. She'll show you mine. It's very... It's 
it's it's not great. <laughs> but we're happy to be here. Yes. Lots of families here.